hello everyone welcome to my channel welcome back if you've been here before i'm beautiful life forever aka tay so i'm gonna go ahead and get started i'm going to prime my eyes with the jubilee's place concealer in 16 and set it with the aba setting powder in deep peach Next, I'm using the Beauty Bay Berries Eyeshadow Palette. I'm just gonna take that shade and put that in my crease. And then I'm gonna take that light pink shade as well as the darker pink shade and I'm gonna put those in my lids. Also, if you're watching and you're not subscribed, please make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit the bell, you click all, so you'll be alerted of all my uploads. I upload a new short every Monday and a new video every Friday. Also, please make sure to click the like button on my shorts and videos because that helps my channel and it helps with my content being shown. Now I'm using the CoverGirl Get In Line Liquid Eyeliner. Next I'm using the House of Lashes Eyelash Glue in my Ioni Eyelashes. Moving on to my face, I'm using the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Chill. Now I'm using the Everyday Humans Rose from Above Mineral Sunscreen. For primer, I'm using the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Mattifying Primer. Next, I'm using the Elf Orange Camel Color Corrector to correct the dark spots on my face and neck.
keep my makeup matte and to keep my face from getting oily, I'm using the Be Pure Blurring Press Powder in Medium Deep. For foundation, I'm using the Uma by Sharon C Skin Perfecting Foundation in Bronze Venus T5. For some more coverage, I'm using the Elf Camel Concealer in Deep Chestnut. And I'm just putting this the same places where I put the orange corrector at. To highlight, I'm using the Ulta Beauty Full Coverage Concealer in Medium Warm. I'm just putting this all the places where the light will naturally hit my face. While that concealer is sitting, I'm going to use the Beauty Bay Bronzer and Chestnut. I'm just going to use this to contour my nose and bronze the other parts of my face. I'm using the Huda Beauty Setting Powder and Cinnamon Bun to set where I have that concealer at. Next, I'm using the Fenty Beauty Soft Matte Powder Foundation, the shade 440, as my all over face powder. Now, I'm using the Morphe Blush Sculpting Powder, and this is in the shade New Pursuit. To highlight, I'm using the Black Radiance True Complexion 3D Highlighter Palette, and I'm just going to use that shade in the middle to highlight. Next, I'm using the LA Colors High Shine Lip Gloss and Hyper and the NYX Lip Liner in Club Hopper. To 
to set my face, I'm using the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. And that is it for this makeup tutorial. Hope you all enjoyed this sparkling pink eyeshadow look that I did. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Make sure you hit the bell and you click all. So you'll be alert about my uploads. So I upload a new short every Monday and a new video every Friday. And like I mentioned before, please make sure to click the like button on my shorts and videos because it helps my channel and helps with my content being shown. Um, if you have any suggestions as far as makeup looks, please let me know so that I can do them. Also, everything I use will be listed in the description box as well as on my social media handles. And I appreciate each and every one of you watching. Thank you so much. And I'll see you all in the next one. Make sure you take care of yourselves. Bye. Thank you.